Hi guys and welcome back to the best YouTube channel in the world. I look a little rough right now. I'm very much well of it, which is the whole point of this video. I'm trying to I'm trying to force a glow up because it's the same but everyone's looking good and I still look like this because I'm trying to save money. This is my attempt at a glow up basically. But I'm gonna be copying someone else's glow up, hence me recreating a Pinterest look. Also check out this top of mine. I just got it. Anyways, let us start with the video. I think we should first do my hair. Yeah, let's first do my hair. So the look that I'm gonna go for is very really simple, but also like a kind of glam look. This is the look. Yeah, so she has her hair back. By the way, I love Belle so much. She is one of the first like beauty influencers that I've followed. I don't know. I just like the way she talks. Her British accent is really cute. Also, I appreciate my roots. Like, three weeks back and they're already grown. Can you ever see that? I don't know. So I'm just going to slick my hair back. Or should I use gel? Or should I use gel when I'm done? Okay. Oh, sorry. Okay, the bun is all slicked back. I think, I don't know. And now we're going to take off my hair from the packet. Mm -hmm. that my neighbor can literally see what I'm doing right now it's crazy I get blinded myself I got the biggest mirror I could find oh shit my neighbor can literally see I'm gonna first start with my eyebrows this is not a tutorial by the way I'm just gonna speed through everything thing is that I removed the curtain so I can have brighter lighting. Okay, anyways, let's start. I am being completely, I'm just waiting my story. If I'm being completely honest with you guys, this is the second time I'm doing this look. And the first time it turned out pretty well, I'll insert some pictures. Like I stopped recording and I didn't notice that I stopped recording. Also my brow bar is finished. But it turned out really well, but like it was, I wasn't happy about the base. So basically I'm just gonna use what's left of my brow bar and then just like soap like soap. I'm just gonna laminate my brows down and then I'm gonna fill them in. My eyebrows are quite natural, so I'm gonna try my best to do like a natural brow. And I did cut I did cut my eyebrows with scissors. I used cuticle scissors to cut my eyebrows. And I think it worked. I don't know some biscuits because I cannot sit that still so it's done so I can finish this look Oh my thigh is burning. The sun is really, really, really out there today. I'm using this concealer that I got from Mr. Not Mr. Price. Ackermans. It's, oh, it smells good. That's why I bought it at Quantity 10. Okay? It just smells good. I don't know if it actually works. I don't know if I should do foundation. Because the, the truth is, I don't like the feel of foundation on my skin. And every time when like someone who's doing a makeup tutorial doesn't use foundation it actually makes me sick to my <gasps> it actually makes me sick to my thick and stomach but i'm gonna use it for full effect although this foundation is not it's not my shade it has like an orangey and it, i don't know but it's not my it's not my shade so i'm gonna i'm gonna try to spread this all over to make it like as thin as possible I'm learning to trust the process honestly if there's one thing i learned this year was to trust the freaking process yeah, yeah, i'm gonna blend this out the best way i can i'm gonna use this little powder puff thing because i can't i can't do it and i'm not bothered to the point honestly 
um this is how it's looking so far the it's still not 100 percent but i'm not done i am still learning to trust the process also i can't find my powder puff i can't find my powder puff to apply the powder um, i'm using my brow gel to like kind of create like a contour here like a bit looking hectic and I just know it's gonna be sticky, but it's really good. It's the thought that counts. At least I'm doing it. Maybe I put on my cheeks there. Maybe I should use my finger. There. Also on my eyelids here. Yeah. Okay, so I've done the like the base of the eye. Like also smoke it out there to create like a like a kind of cat eye thing. Look at me talking as if I'm what I'm actually doing. I'm trying to make it as symmetrical as possible, but this eye looks darker than that eye, but who's who's gonna know? Who's gonna know except for you guys? I'm almost done with the base. I'm gonna do blush I'm using the brow gel again. I like the orangey one because I like orangish blush, like a dark orange blush. Let me see how she applied her blush real quick. Her blush does create like a little elongated look. I don't know how to describe that. And I try my best to apply it like that. I don't know if it looks good. I can't see anything to be honest. If I'm being completely honest with you guys, my eyes like really sucks. I'm just gonna put some more on this side because this side looks lighter than the other side. Yeah, I think I got it down. I'm sure it looks a bit dark, darker than mine so i'm gonna add a bit more maybe dip into some black as well mix the brown and black whoa i made it too dark yo i made it too dark okay it looks a bit better in low lighting than it does it's in like harsh direct sunlight I just need you guys to trust the process. Okay, my phone is overheating, so I'm gonna put it down here. Um, I couldn't find my powder puff, so I went to open another one. Okay, if this makes it on YouTube. <laughs> Decided to change my sitting. Oh my eye. I just like I decided to change where I'm sitting because like uh, uh, the sun is literally in my eyes. Oh my god, my palette! I wanna put on. Don't mind this broken. This is my favorite brush to apply blush because it's nice and small. And I'm just wanna. I just wanna darken my. Just wanna darken my blush. I changed to my iPad so I can see my face better. But this is the side with the blush, powder blush, and the liquid blush. This is the side with just the liquid blush. And I think I like this side more, so I'm gonna add. A bit more blush. The difference is visible. I don't like my eyes. They look like raccoon eyes, but I'm gonna fix that in my mouth. Someone knows. I never understood people who put like their blush everywhere. I mean, I still kind of don't, but I kind of do because I literally go up to here. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It just brightens my, like, especially when I have foundation on, which is like kind of rare because when you have foundation on your face is one color like it's one color and no one's face is one color i'm sorry now i want to put on the glitter i'm gonna use this very flat brush i'm gonna use like a silver glitter because i think that's the kind of glitter she's using use this one I think I like this eye more than this eye. There's something off about this eye. I can't find my black pencil eyeliner. I mean, I can't find it, but um, it's not. It's not sharpened, so I'm gonna use my my the one the pencil that I used to line my lips and my eyebrow. The difference. I'm not gonna do the inner corner thing because like my inner corner is kind of folded over and it's gonna look so bad. So I'm gonna try the wing using this um marker thing I got from Metal World. And not the best at creating wings, but you're gonna see. So I'm gonna look straight ahead 
and then it doesn't look half as bad as I thought it was gonna look. Just gonna fill it in. I'm gonna fill it in using the brown because I think I actually like the brown. Guys, they both look bad. They both look bad. Did you see that? Did you see that? But this one kind of looks bad. I'm gonna try to remove the powder and see. I tried to redo it, but not much difference. They're not twins. They're not even sisters. But what's important is that they're not enemies. They're friends. Should I add my brush? No. Mm. I heard that if you want to get your lashes look, to look really nice, you have to close your eye and then apply like on your lips. Look. But I don't do that. I usually open the powder now because I think uh, I need a new mascara. I think this one is running out because oh, there is a difference. I think we might be going to the mall. Could be right, could be wrong. So maybe this look is gonna be my mall look. I just get to be mysterious at the mall, and I just walk I hit, like behind my family, so I can look like a lonely tourist or something. It never works. It never works. It literally never works. But I just like doing that so now maybe with the maybe with the makeup is gonna work I don't know that's too much so I'm gonna take this off and then blend my forehead out because I know it's too shades right now even look at that slick band that's not at all slick look at my natural entrance okay and then you're gonna see my bossy marriages. No, no, some of us have gone through it. I'm just gonna use my regular lip liner. But I like, the eyeliner is quite thick, so I'm gonna use this, I'm gonna use this maroon lipstick as my liner and hope that it attains it. What about. Yeah, no, I think the, the easiest part I'm messing up, I should just use the brown lip liner. Maybe it's not too late. Okay, okay, I think I can see it. Okay. I think I fixed it. I think I fixed it. I feel like my makeup is not really properly done my neck, but like, don't focus on that, guys. So this is my lip gloss. My mascara is Yabby London, and this I just got from a Chinese shop. And then eyeliner, Retin Wild. This I got from Signature. I don't know what else I use. Yay! Yeah, what's up, guys? I'm really old, probably older than you. I don't know. I used to be my mom's, I found it in our kitchen drawer so I'm just using it to add glitter because she also has glitter on her lip Ooh. now I'm going to take this and then put beauty marks all over my face I'm just going to darken for the ones that I already have like this one here and then those two. I like to put them in my nose. And put them on my forehead. Yeah. My brother has one on, on his forehead and I'm so jealous. I think I should add gloss on my lips. What do you guys think? I can't find proper lip gloss. I'm going to use this lip therapy. Okay. I think that looks good. Finish that. Like this, guys. Oh, this is what it looks like in the sun. I think it looks good. I think I did a good job. The way I'm judging that it looks good, and I don't even have my glasses to like check. Um, okay, is it working? I think it looks good. Stop. 
my neighbor my neighbor literally keeps walking past here but like okay he saw me talking to myself yeah i hope you guys really enjoyed watching the video as much as i enjoyed making it this was honestly so much fun and if you guys would like me to recreate another look or like do anything if you guys want me to do something i will literally do it for you guys i said i would cross the ocean for you guys um yeah i really enjoyed this video so if you guys did please make sure to like and comment and share the video with your friends your family your hot uncle i don't know <laughs> bye guys